Hello, I just got back from the grocery store. Um, I went to Walmart today and I was running behind on basically everything in the house. But um, I got a new calendar that I thought I would show to you guys show you guys. This is a calendar by markings, I believe. There it is. And um, it's a 2012 calendar. It's all on recycled paper. Um, there's the first page. It's your personal information. A small um, calendar outlook. Important holidays. Important dates that you can fill in. And a section for notes. And one of the reasons I went with this particular calendar is because all the months are up front. See that? And I kind of like that. It was kind of different. And then back towards the back are the weekly um, areas where you can keep all your notes and everything else. Um, towards the back, <clears throat> excuse me, towards the back, um, there's a place for addresses and phone numbers. There's also password login places. Um, I don't recommend using this really. Um, I'll talk more about that in a later calendar post. Um, and more room for notes. Now, it has this little band that goes around it. The pages um, are tipped, silver tipped, and I actually like that a lot. I believe this was $9.99. Um, it's a 12-month planner um, with banded leather. Um, does have the recycled pages. I like it. Um, and it's small compared to, say, this calendar which is has crap all in it see the difference there's my coupon thing right there but it's small and um i have been keeping a lot of my stuff on this new phone it's um has a ton of apps that i've been using sorry about my finger and um and i like it and i like the to-do list in my phone um but I still feel better having a backup on pen and paper. If something happens to my phone, say it crashes or I lose it, I'm going to lose everything. Except I am kind of lucky that all my calendar information on my phone is set up with my Google Calendar. So I can go back and forth with Google and that would work. But I like the idea of having one in my purse. And this is the one I'm going to use for 2012. I have been using this, but it's large and I'm tired of trying to pack it into my purse. Her, so I'm going back to a smaller one and i um, pretty excited about it. You guys know I love calendars. Nothing makes me more happy than a organized calendar. And so tonight and tomorrow I'm going to be working like a mad woman getting this all set up and um, recording important dates and getting it going. So do you guys have a favorite calendar for 2012 yet? Um, I'm kind of running behind. I got this one for Christmas and it's fine for the home stuff but I really need one for my personal and that's what this one is um, and um, I'd love to hear if you ha and see a picture of your new 2012 calendar I know we're in February already so most of you have probably already got new calendars for 2012 but you can always take a video response and leave it at the bottom of this post you can email me at mrs. Keisha Jaggers at gmail.com and you can check out the blog at kjaggers.com k-j-a-g-g-e-r-s dot com to um, check out more posts um, and uh, to see what's going on in my neck of the woods thank you for watching and have a beautiful day bye bye